Okay, guys, so we're going to do our first dimensional analysis problem together. So let me read it to you. It says, what is the mass in grams of a 325 milligram aspirin tablet? So I've taken the liberty of writing down the number that was given to us in the problem, 325 milligrams, okay? But it wants us to convert it to grams. Do you guys know the conversion factor between grams and milligrams? Do you guys know it? Yes. Yeah, okay, so what is that conversion factor? One gram, one gram equals 1,000 1, milligrams. Okay, so we're going to have to use that in this problem. Okay, So we want the mass not in milligrams, but in grams, right? So in order to get that, we're going to have to put that conversion factor in a form that's like a ratio. Okay, so remember the two ratios that we could make this? So what's one of them? Can you guys help me out? One gram. One gram divided by? One thousand. Yeah. One thousand milligrams. Or the other one would be what? One thousand. One thousand migs. One gram. Migs, that's milligram, a shortened version. Okay. So, what do we have on top here? So. If you think about this as a ratio of this over one, right? What do we have on top, unit-wise? Milligrams. milligrams. Okay. Do we want milligrams in our final answer? No. 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 So, what do we have to do to them? We got to cancel them out, right? So, in order to cancel them out, do we put them up here or down here? Bottom. On the bottom. So, which one of these two conversion factors are we going to use? The, the lift, this one here, the one on the left, or on the right? The left. left. Okay. So, let's use this guy here, and watch what we do. We put 1,000 milligrams there, one gram, and what happens to milligrams? Cancel out. Okay. So 325 divided by 1,000. If you can't do this in your head, feel free to get your calculator out, okay? So let's all do it together. 325 divided by 1,000 and <coughs> 0.325. So how many significant figures does my calculation have to have? Three. three. So it's got to be three. The one thing you got to remember is those conversion factors never play in to the um, number of significant figures that you have in your final answer, okay? So, since this, only the only number that was given to you in the problem has three, then your answer has to have three as well, okay? So when I look at my calculator, it says 0 0.325 grams. So that's how many grams there are in that aspirin tablet that's 325 milligrams. And then box your answer, and then everybody's in. Okay. There are there any questions on doing this kind of dimensional analysis? So notice what we're doing. We're changing from one unit to another set of units. Okay, so you can do this if you're given or if you know the conversion factor. So metric to metric, like this one is, grams to milligrams. You've got to know those conversion factors. Does everybody understand what I'm saying? Wonderful. <coughs>